They do. Yes, they do. <laughs> About 7.30, uh, we're about to finish preparing, and then breakfast. Which apparently no one's ahead. <laughs> it might start filling up now. This is the medium traffic flow, I think. Yeah, 7.30 to 8.30, moderate breakfast traffic. Michigan got us up early. We didn't go to bed kind of early if she did that. Yeah, we went to bed at like 8? <laughs> 9? We were messed up. That train and the time change, man. <laughs> we'll see you at our breakfast table, I guess. So here we are, at the breakfast table. Just like we said we'd be. <laughs> it was Kelsey. Pretty lame breakfast, but hey, pretty food. I don't know, I kind of like it. I don't like how they didn't give us straws for our drinks. We're sitting by a window, so... We've got this super sweet view of the chilies. Wow, I am seeing inside the store right now. <laughs> Creep. Okay, I just want you guys to realize what just happened. So I asked Cassie for the um, receipt to the trolley bus so I could get the phone number. She gave me the one for her McDonald's. <laughs> And that's how this story ends. How does Joey do this every day? He don't. <laughs> One riveting trolley ride later, we find ourselves at the Field Museum, where we saw totem poles and a whole bunch of other sweet stuff that I forgot to take footage of. Yay! Hey guys, we just got out of the Field Museum. Um, I thought it was quite interesting. A lot of reading. My eyes kind of hurt right now, but yeah. You know, you start to realize that a lot of things that we're used to seeing in popular culture and media are just depictions from storytellers, really. Yeah, like that Lucifer thing. Lucifer thing, Lucifer, Lucifer, Lucifer. Vikings. <laughs> yeah. They don't even have horns on their helmets. We found out where the stuff was. Yes. <laughs> it's here. <laughs> Cool. There were like 7,000 kids here! Yeah, and they were all bored out of their minds. <laughs> we are walking the Chicago skyline right now. Because uh, we thought it would be appropriate and at least more interesting than we are. This isn't weird at all. I'm sure they have 100 vloggers here. <laughs> it's mostly LA, isn't it? Oh god, every other person holding a camera up in front of their face. <laughs> and they still think it's awkward. We're almost there now. We're gonna take a picture of the front and then the, that'll probably be it. Because it'll be too dark to take pictures. See you then! It's actually quite bright in here. Never mind. Hey guys, we are now at the Alder Planetarium and we are in an actual planetarium about to experience the Undiscovered Worlds show. Yes? Um, I don't know. Apparently. Yeah. Like IMAX type deal, right? Is it IMAX the kind of. Oh, yeah. No, it would be like this, but you know, just a theater. <laughs> and the screen's only facing frontward. Cut that out. <laughs> what are you gonna eat, Kelsey? I really want some Chicago pizza. I do too, I was just thinking that. I want some pepperoni, sausage, maybe some type of chicken. Alright, we're doing a two sided thing then. Lots and lots of, well, not lots of cheese, because I don't want to be constipated tonight. <laughs> this is gonna be really nice. Especially because, you know, we never get to see the- Oh, the lights are going off. Alright guys, see you later. Hey guys! Just got out of the Adler Planetarium. <laughs> <laughs> and um... That was pretty freaking sweet. <laughs> Will not lie. Pretty stars. Yeah, and you know, it makes you realize just how finite we are. We are just literally not even measurable on a planetary scale. Yeah. We're like little specks of dust. Not even. 
We're about to hit up that uh, Chicago style pizza. You heard me? <laughs> then <laughs> probably at Walgreens again. Oh yeah, Mariah's midnight snacks. <laughs> <laughs> more popcorn, more ridiculousness. Tonight I think we'll be staying up longer. <laughs> oh boy. Don't say that until it gets to like 9 o'clock and we're like out. Cold <laughs> again. I think the maid came in there yet? I'm kind of scared. My yeah. MacBook's in there. I know. It makes me nervous just leaving my shampoo out there. <laughs> <laughs> You're like just gonna steal your mom's kinky moves. Poison it. <laughs> Put hair dye in it. <laughs> it's pink too, so pink hair dye on me? No. <laughs> <laughs> Next time you'll see us, we'll be at a pizza joint. In the Chicago pizza. Apparently, according to the tour driver, that Chicago doesn't even have the best pizza. And he lives here. <laughs> it has the fifth best pizza. <laughs> right behind Italy, Japan, New York. Frickin' Japan beat Italy. How is that even a thing? And they put like squid on theirs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but we're coming up to a group of people, and this is probably getting weird, so I'm just gonna turn it off. See you, bye! Hey! Alright, guys, we are officially official. <laughs> we are at the pizzeria, and this one is called Pizzeria Uno. I'll actually take a picture of the outside from the leaves. But, um, the authentic Chicago style pizza. We have the pepperoni, it's half pepperoni, and then my half is pepperoni, sausage, and chicken, because I can't control myself. <laughs> there is a lot of beer, like, wow. <laughs> I didn't know where this was that type of restaurant. We are tourists. I'm a vlogging tourist, it's a little bit worse. Here we are, with the pizza in front of us. I have the chicken, pepperoni, and sausage, and Cassie's super lame with just the pepperoni. That you can't tell, because it's all covered in sauce. You guys, <laughs> they gave us earplugs this time. <laughs> the maid came in and gave us earplugs. And put her charger back under her computer. Yeah, that was nice. I like this place again. What? Ugh, we are back at the hotel now. No, Full of cheese dome sauce. No <laughs> pepperoni, which I would like to have. It's weird, because we definitely ordered a pepperoni pizza. <laughs> but that waitress must have clocked out or something and didn't give the order right, because it was just cheese. <laughs> I mean, I had sausage and chicken, but I think I could tell that there were pepperoni in there. Yeah. I had just pepperoni, and there was new pepperoni in there. And the troll freaking left us, so... Yeah! <laughs> it was supposed to stop at Field Museum at 4.15. We were there at, like, 4 or 6. And we saw it. And it rolled past. <laughs> Success. It was okay. <laughs> Transportation was an issue. Is that a kid? He's a kid on ridiculousness. Yeah, he's famous for something. There's a bar right across the street that we can't attend. Well, we can. But we'll be sitting there drinking our juice from a bottle. A baby bottle with a nipple on it. <laughs> the rum and coke minus the rum please. <laughs> <laughs> Tomorrow's looking like uh, Art Institute. Uh, Millennium Park, perhaps. Apparently it's gonna snow and sleet and other crazy crap. But it's right next to the Art Institute, right? Yeah. We've got the Art Institute, the Millennium Park, we gotta get our free shirt. And then we have to wait for the next freaking bus after the free shirt thing. And then... We want to go to the water tower place. We've been talking on a bed. This is probably interesting for some people more than others. If we were attractive. <laughs> we're fairly pretty, aren't we? Like the video, if you think we are. Match. <laughs> and I'm like, for you. 
The 3D is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> we're processing the faster loading. We can go to Walgreens now. <laughs> 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 Trying to gain my favor back. <laughs> but, yeah. Well.